Now, the Buffalo Hall of Fame experience has two big events coming up. Teresa Fortin Barnes is here to explain. She's the director of St strategic planning and she's with a good company this morning because she is with John Lang, who is the second fan who will be inducted onto the Wall Hall of Fame. That's the Fan Wall of Fame uh, as Bill's Elvis, who we have seen so many times on TV, John. <laughs> Thanks, you Fred. going crazy with the guitar <laughs> after we score a touchdown. So congratulations to you. Thank you so much. I bet this was a big surprise. It huh? was. It was a huge surprise. Wow. Yeah. Well, you know, it, you're number two because our, our, the lovely gentleman yeah. who, who portrayed Pancho Bila was mm -hmm. first. But John, you're second. You're in very good company. Oh. Yeah, 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 it's a huge honor. Yeah, huge honor. so Teresa, tell us yes. about this. Tell us where this, this is going to be taking place, where we can see John's name enshrined. So on Monday night, Chris Berman is going to be in town, and uh, we called it Circling the Wagons yep. with Chris Berman, appropriately enough. That's why I... I love your Chris Berman shirt. my T-shirt, yeah, look right? Look at that. And so it's at the town ballroom, six to nine o'clock. Mm -hmm. He has a big music background. A lot of people <laughs> don't know. He loves to sing with bands. So he agreed to do this for us. And we, um, we took him up on the opportunity. And so then we wanted to induct another fan. We thought it was so appropriate to have Elvis. Yes. Not only for, you know, for his, what mm -hmm. he's done since 1992 has been amazing, but it's Elvis. Yeah, yeah. It's a music. We event. love Elvis, it's right? Right, venue. right. It's he just might Berman. get up and sing. Who We're knows? Gonna, hopefully, Chris will sing an Elvis song with him. But Chris is going to sing a bunch. So, so we've been talking, and actually, Pancho Bila you know, gave us a, the blessing because he was the first one, and he's been he was involved with you know us getting um, Elvis and next too. So that was very touching and. Um, uh, so we it were was, very excited, yeah. It's going to be great. Yeah. yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. John, yeah. were you surprised when they called you? I was very surprised. Yeah? Yeah, I really was. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What yeah. made you start doing this? <laughs> it was basically a total goof back in 1992 to try and get on television. And a buddy of mine bet me that I couldn't get on. And uh, I painted up uh, an old guitar I had in my apartment and put, like, squish the fish on the back of it. And uh, had great seats, and they had me on. and. Uh, my whole section had a riot with it. They kept saying, you got to do this again. Yes, you gotta do it yes. Again. And I had so much fun with it, too. And I mean, my wife was painting sideburns on I me. Remember, I remember those big sideburns. <laughs> yeah. Well, so that's con well, congratulations. Thank you so much. Now, we want people to know that um, that John will be inducted by broadcaster Chris Berman. And Chris will, again, be singing with the Twain Gang Band, which is, again, happening at the town ballroom. But Teresa. The Hope Buffalo uh, Hall of Fame experience, we're looking for a home to put all of our mm -hmm. Hall of Fames together. Right. Right? Right. Under one roof, that's mm -hmm. the ultimate goal. That's why we're doing events like this, fundraising, fundraising. So uh, behind the scenes, a lot of work is going on with a lot of different people to find that space. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, the Greater Buffalo Sports Hall of Fame had to move out of our location. And we always knew that was temporary mm -hmm. anyways of the Key Bank Center, so now we're in storage. All right. of our stuff is in storage, like the broadcaster yep. stuff is in storage, and music, a lot of the music stuff is in storage. So we're working on bringing that all under one roof in a very interactive yes. facility, which will be so fun, that Hadley Exhibits on Elmwood would um, put together. Foyt Albert, Al Foyt Albert is designing the plan. So we, we have some secret things we're working on right now we can't make mention of, but. We really need the Buffalo community and beyond to, to get behind this project. Yes, yes, it's very to support exciting. this, to yeah. support this so we can raise the money uh, to, to put this, to make this a brick and mortar place. Right, exactly. Where John's name goes up on the wall there, the broadcasters, the sports, and the music hall of fame can all be together. Correct. Chris Berman is a good time, let me tell you. <laughs> yeah. So do come on out to this event, enjoy Chris Berman. He's the one who coined the phrase, the Buffalo Bills are circling the wagons, right. okay? Yes. He's gonna be singing with the Twang Gang, silent auction, food, refreshments. General admission is only $30, VIP ticket $75, okay? Buffalo Hall of Fame experience. We're looking for a new permanent home and you can help by attending this. So congratulations to John Lang, who is our incredible Elvis every single week out at the Buffalo <laughs> Bills Stadium. And Teresa Fortin Barnes, thank you so much. Yes, Information up you. on the screen, everybody. Please support this because it's who we are.